Sacramento, where the celebration is ready to begin. That's right. This whole store has everything that you need for Dia de los Muertos. They're, they even have an altar set up here just to kind of show you all the festive things that they have in this store. We're a culture, and they just recently opened this wing of the store. You can see everything has those cute little sugar skulls on them. Look, baby piñata, my favorite. And then there's some pottery around here. Those are great for the wall, or you can just leave them on the floor. So cool. And so Elba... If I could make my way here, I didn't realize this is going to be such a struggle when I made this. Overcompensated a little bit. Here we go. Where, where am I not going to block you? Come, step on over here this way. Yeah. Okay. So there's also some amazing art here that really like emphasizes the whole culture of Dia de los Muertos. Uh, we do have a few pieces here. Um, as you can see here on the wall, we have Octavio Campo. Um, these are paintings that are imported from um, Mexico, so they, they are all the way from, from our native land or my native land. Um, we also have a local, local artist here. Um, the sugar school that, that you saw briefly, um, that is from Raul Mejia. He is a local artist. He does a couple of pieces for us, um, as well as another artist. Um, his name is Joshua, and he's done a couple of, of pieces for us, including um, this beautiful artwork. As you can see, um, entering onto the other side. So this is our newest side. So thank you guys for being here and checking it out. We've been here for less than a year. Um, we do have a little bit of everything. So you will find um, sugar schools, as you mentioned, also as figurines, um, Dia de los Muertos figurines. So what are these like figurines usually used for? Just decoration? A lot of the time they are used for decor. Um, it, they do express our Mexican tradition. So. The bailes flocoricos, uh, um, as you can see, like the working man with the poncho and the hat. Um, so it's a, it's a symbol of Mexico in our in our cultural, so very culture um, inclined. So you guys get something new every day. I was looking at those magnets. If Steve, could, since I can't reach it, if Steve could bend over, look at the little empanadas. They're like little pasteles, right? Um, they are. So those pieces actually just came in last week. We did take a trip over to Mexico. Um, Jalisco Tonala, uh, and we did pick up those pieces, so I think those are just amazing and awesome. So what time are you guys open? We are here on Sundays from 10 to 4. Um, we are closed Mondays. Um, we are here Monday through, uh, excuse me, Tuesday through Saturday uh, from 10 to 7, Perfect. 11 to 7, um, so you'll find us here. Perfect, so if you need anything to celebrate Dia de los Muertos, you can come on over here and check out all the great stuff they have. Thanks, Erica. Well, it is a question that ha everyone has on their mind, and this morning we are getting answers.